Hi and welcome to episode number 525 with whatsforchild.com. After a crazy new year and a little time out, we're back. After all the festivities are done, most people are looking at recipes to cut the calories. This is not one of them. Whether you decide to coat these little wonders with chocolate or just have them plain, honeycomb is just super yummy. To start, place the corn syrup or Lyle's golden syrup, caster sugar, cream of tartar, white wine vinegar and water in a deep pot. Half fill a large pan with water at room temperature. Place the pot over medium high heat and stir the mixture until the sugar is dissolved and everything is well combined. Bring the mixture up to 300 Fahrenheit or 154 Celsius. To judge this you will need a candy thermometer or an infrared thermometer. While the mixture heats up, line an 8x8 inch baking pan with baking parchment. As the mixture comes to the correct temperature, remove the pot from the heat and carefully lower it into the pan of water. Add the bicarbonate of soda and whisk this into the mixture. The mixture will froth up like a volcano. This is why you need a deep pot. The cooling bath cools the mixture just enough to ensure a nice fine texture of bubble in the honeycomb. Remove the pot from the cooling bath and pour the honeycomb into the lined baking pan. Quickly level off the surface and put this aside to set. Once the mixture has set solid, turn it out of the pan. Use your meat mallet and a butter knife as a chisel to fracture the honeycomb into bite-sized pieces. And there it is, a beautifully finely textured honeycomb to add a little sweetness to the beginning of your new year. Thanks for joining us today. Please subscribe to our channel and we'll see you again tomorrow.